I am pursuing a master's in environmental science. I am doing my thesis work on toxins and Lake Trafford, seasonality of algae. And uh, right here at this lab, we're working with qPCR, PCR machines to see what kind of uh, genes that these um, algae have, if they have the ability to make these toxins. And then we have uh, the ELISA machine that's going to tell us if they're actually making the toxins after we freeze and lyse the cells. When I was looking for uh, universities to study at, to get my master's at, I came across Dr. Barry Rosen and I saw that he had a very broad resume of working with uh, different agencies, with different types of algae, doing different things with algae, and I thought that that was really cool because I knew that I was interested in algae, but I didn't know uh, particularly in what fashion or aspect I wanted to work with them in. Um, so I thought that uh, with him having such a broad background that I would be able to learn the most that I could about algae. The things that I love the most about working in this lab are uh, working with genes. I didn't really realize how much gene <laughs> work I would be getting into, the uh, algal genes, and uh, I think it's really cool to be able to put certain primers in and be able to amplify that and see what algae is producing, what toxins potentially. And uh, the human health aspect is really huge there. Uh, it just has a very direct relationship to helping the general public. I also took a coral reef ecology class this semester because I thought that it was really pertinent and would go along nicely with my scientific diving class to give me a better appreciation of what I was seeing out there and uh, just to really push that scientific aspect of the diving and uh, continue my own knowledge on being able to determine what kind of corals I'm seeing, why I'm seeing them there, um, even different algae, calcareous algae, the reef builders and the kind of fish, uh, why they uh, are in certain locations or aren't. When I talk to people about algae, I talk about my work specifically is looking at toxins. Of course, not all algae is bad. There's algae, even like spirulina, that we eat. So there's all kinds of different facets of algae that you can look at, and uh, I'm really excited to continue to look into them. <laughs>